A local social work organization has officially launched an eight-year-long professional mentoring program for children from low-income families, the first of its kind here to help them maximize their potential and break the cycle of poverty. Under the STAR program by Shine Children and Youth Services, each child will be assigned a full-time professional mentor called a friend from the age of 6 to 14. They will meet on a weekly basis for educational support and mentoring to develop social-emotional competencies. The mentors will journey with the children through two milestones in the developmental years, entry into primary and secondary schools. They are paid and are trained in social work or early childhood education and can effectively communicate with the children and their families. Existing support schemes for disadvantaged children, such as Circle of Care, Kids Start as well as Health and Development Support in Preschool Partnerships heads up. And, when they turn seven. These schemes provide support for preschool children from low-income families and also include healthcare services. Speaking at the launch of the STAR program at Safra Choa Chukal on November 25, Trade and Industry Minister Gon Kim Yong said that the mentors play an important role as they build a sustained and consistent relationship that provides a safe space for the children to express themselves, help them discover their strengths and pursue their aspirations. Said Mr. Gon, this program is also designed to instill a love for learning, encourage curiosity, and foster a growth mindset. When a child is inspired to see challenges not as roadblocks but as opportunities for growth, we unlock a mindset that will serve them well throughout their lives. The aim of the program is to enable social mobility by preparing these children to effectively deal with challenges they may face in life so that they maximize their potential and break the cycle of poverty. Since June 2023, Shine Children and Youth Services has enrolled 36-year-olds in the STAR program, with three mentors assigned to them. By the third year, it hopes to enroll 100 children and have 10 mentors. The program currently serves children from low-income families who live in government rental flats in Choa Chu Kong. Queenstown and Langkok Boru. Shine works with social service officers, as well as family service centers and primary schools in these areas to identify children who can benefit from the program. It is modeled after the Friends of the Children program in the United States, where paid professional mentors a child for 12 years to break generational poverty. Mr. Lee Seng Meng. Executive Director of Shine Children and Youth Services said the Harvard Business School Association of Oregon evaluated that the return on investment is $7 for every $1 invested in each child. He said the STAR program was conceptualized and implemented following a study trip supported by Octava Foundation in October 2022 to Portland and Los Angeles. It will be reviewed on a yearly basis by local think tank. Research for impact to assess its sustainability as well as the possibility of scaling up the program in other areas in Singapore. Shine will also assign parenting support specialists to the parents so that they can build parenting competencies and have access to resources to provide a conducive environment for their children's development. Octava Foundation and the Mo Family Foundation have provided Shine with initial seed funding to roll out the program. However, Shine said it will need to carry out fundraising and seed grants to ensure that the program is able to meet its objective of providing a mentor to each child for eight years. We hope to rally more partners to come on board the STAR program to bring about transformative change, said Mr. Lee, adding that the social work organization welcomes support whether in terms of funding, programs or resources. A 33-year-old unemployed mother of three daughters, who declined to be named, said her six-year-old has received help in many areas through the weekly sessions with her mentor or friend. The friend has taught my child how to speak good English and also prepared her for primary school. 
The friend has also helped her to learn new words and communicate with others properly and confidently. She said, adding that her daughter has also gained skills in problem-solving.